How come some people feel so alive during a fast while others feel like they have the flu? The answer, my friends, is electrolytes. We want to help you during your intermittent fasting journey, so let's find out all about electrolytes and their consumption during fasting. Electrolytes are minerals that serve important functions in the body. They regulate nerve and muscle function, hydrate the body, balance blood pressure, and help rebuild damaged tissue. And you get your electrolytes mainly from food. So as you can imagine, not eating during fasting may create some problems in the electrolyte department. When electrolytes are deficient, your body starts sending emergency signals. You may feel confused, fatigued, have a headache, or always experience unpleasant cramps. During intermittent fasting, there may be low electrolyte levels because of low intake of mineral-containing beverages, prolonged fasting, profuse sweating through exercise, unbalanced diet. Recovering your electrolytes will not only make your body say thank you, but it will make your fasting easier and more efficient. Yes, intermittent fasting can bring a bunch of benefits for your health and weight loss, but it still needs careful practice to not worsen your overall wellness. And it's not a secret that one of the reasons people quit fasting is the discomfort that may occur. But you can get everything under control. Just remember this golden rule and repeat after us. Electrolyte intake is the first step to success in your fasting weight loss journey. We want to make your journey 100% successful, so we answered frequently asked questions about fasting and electrolyte consumption. Let's see what we got. Can I take electrolytes while fasting? Without any room for doubt, yes, you can. Electrolytes are essential minerals for a wide amount of functions in your body. By the way, do you take electrolytes while fasting and which ones? Share in the comments below. Why are electrolytes important for fasting? Electrolytes are essential during intermittent fasting because you are eating less and fewer electrolytes are entering your body. To avoid health complications, electrolyte supplementation is a must. Here is a list of the most important electrolytes for the human body. These minerals are involved in muscle and nerve function, fluid balance, and blood pressure regulation. By the way, it's also important to take electrolyte supplements if losses are due to vomiting and diarrhea. Is salt an electrolyte and does it break the fast? Sodium is one of the most important electrolytes because it retains water and promotes hydration. Its main function is to maintain fluid balance in the body. People are always questioning how much salt they should have because of its association with weight gain. Salt is a mineral that does not add calories to food. For this reason, salt does not break the fast. The way salt contributes to weight gain is because it causes fluid retention. By increasing the volume of fluids in the body, it makes it look like a fat gain. It is very important to choose the correct type of salt. The best options you can take are Himalayan pink salt and sea salt. These not only contain sodium, but also other important minerals. According to the American Heart Association, no more than 2300 milligrams of sodium per day should be consumed. How to get electrolytes while fasting? When you're fasting, you can get your electrolytes during both fasting hours and feeding hours. To avoid breaking the fast during fasting hours, you can consume water with sea salt, water with Himalayan pink salt and lemon drops, water with sea salt and drops of fresh orange juice, bone broth, beef bone broth, unsalted vegetable broth which should be strained. But what about sports drinks? Well, they aim to restore electrolytes, but some are very high in sugar and will break the fast. To avoid this, replace them with those options that we suggested before. During eating windows, make sure to recharge with natural foods. Aim to include organic foods when possible to get more vitamins and minerals. In this list, you can see some food options and what kind of electrolytes they provide. When are electrolyte supplements necessary? A balanced diet is enough to maintain an adequate level of electrolytes. If you are a high-level athlete or you sweat a lot during your workouts, sports drinks can be a great help. When fasting, it is best to do your workouts during feeding times. But if you exercise while fasting, the best option to replenish electrolyte losses is to drink water with salt after the workout. This way, you will not break the fast. Watch the video about apple cider vinegar for weight loss and another one about 5 biggest intermittent fasting mistakes. See you next time!